we have financials that uh, will link uh, to their farmers so that they will support them financially to access inputs. And when they access uh, quality inputs, certified seeds, they are able to produce more and we are also able to get volumes to supply to our uh, large markets. This issue of predictability, yes, the government needs to raise resources. Yes, you need to reflect certain things as go on in these markets. But when they simply come up and say, if Thursday the Minister of Finance, next Thursday that is, the Minister of Finance comes and says there's another extra tax that's been put on or one that's been taken off, how does that help in this country being able to do business? We need to have a predictable tax, tax regime for planning purposes and, and also just for certainty with one of the kind of rules of taxation. So we need to have a, um, a system that's predictable. Unfortunately, the way our, our, uh, the Revenue Authority and, and National Treasury will think through, especially if we come through 2014, it's about just getting the short-term gain without looking at uh, the long-term uh, impact on this. However, with the new constitutional dispensation and the way now budget process uh, happens, it's not like what used to happen back in the days where the Minister for Finance had a mysterious briefcase and, and uh, taxes would raise midnight. With a change now where he presents a statement of intent to Parliament, uh, Parliament now has the power to so like veto and change uh, what needs to be done from a tax point of view. We must remember that taxes are under a broad agenda. The, com the country starts, first of all, by having a footprint, a development footprint, or, or, or blueprint, rather. Uh, in our case, it's Vision 2030. So for government, you start with the bigger picture. What is the end result? As a country, we want to be a middle-income, industrializing economy with a high quality of life for our citizens by 2030. And we've broken that down into the medium-term plans, and that's what helps the government prioritize from a policy level so that they are able to know what their expenditure will be, what revenues they require in order to spend that money. We hear very little of the tax being the problem. They'll talk about everything from energy to imports to basically the competitiveness went down. It's very rare that they'll actually have the word tax in the complaint. Large contract market currently is uh, East Africa Maltings. They have contracted us to... For instance, this season, we all know the experience with the droughts. We are happy that we'll offer plowing services and reaping services to our farmers. Then uh, packaging. Chango, wafanya hiyo nini waongeze kama ni tax, ama wafanya any tax regulations. Iwe ina take some months, at least kila mtu wakua.